Hello everybody, thank you for joining us. Today we'll be doing a quick somersault sketch. So a person uh, performing a somersault <coughs> action. And now somersaults, there's no particular uh, direction in which you can go. There's uh, actually a whole lot you can do with this. We can cover a range of videos, but we are doing one certain pose today that is uh, in my estimate quite essential so we'll do a curve and you might have guessed that this is actually the main the central point the, the central frame of the torso because when we are somersaulting unless we are stretching out and trying to land or just starting off the somersault and going into that central point where the body is curled up it is this what we normally see and then right here I have the lower part of the torso upper part of the torso of course it's here so this is so somersault also as in upside down now I could have like sketched this uh, uh, from the head to the to the feet but that would not be accurate so we'll do the we'll, it's still the head to the feet but the head is here the feet are here and that is essential for this particular uh, action so part of the thigh right here and the lower leg we'll decide what to do with the other leg very shortly and here we have the shoulder or the delt area arm Again, like you have to like pack everything in so you could even like do this and work around it but you could go one step at a time and then of course the adjoining shoulders which will be hidden I guess in this view around that point bent torso and then the collar is here so we're just going to what you call um, Put in the head and popularly when it's a somersault due to the concentration being put in the head is normally hunched or tucked into the body like that right and we have the other arm there will be some foreshortening because this will appear larger than that that is in the background this is in the foreground and right here also let's actually change this a little bit we will start with this angle here so there is some foreshortening brought into play here so this is appearing quite bigger and we have our foot the first foot here so now we'll go with a pen and see what we can do with this so what I have is bent torso right there so the chest area probably of course compressed it's an extreme pose and let's see he has some slacks on for the sake of comfort and what I've done here is I'm using foreshortening bring about that first foot so I decided to place it there but then I brought it further inward and then of course the delt and the arm stretched out customarily it would be nice to have like take your time about it I'm actually doing this very quick so that we can just get things on paper right away and then I 
backward sorry to the back of the head and I put in the head right there and of course from this angle eyes nose mouth ear somewhere around here now the other arm as I said that there will be some for shortening involved here and we are just going in and putting in the arm there and then the other leg so it's in the background somewhere and you could do so many like things with it but we will say that it's spread out somewhere there so we'll just go in and put in the other foot somewhere there put in a portion of the leg right there so that is somersaulting right there that's one angle but now there's some things that you could some different things that you could do with this and uh, you could also as I had primarily done bring the legs here and go like that so tucked closer together with lesser for shortening and the other leg will be of course right against that one so it's like in the circus kind of thing you can also do different things with the arms here if you stretch that pack more and get the delt upward really stretch the part of this body here you could even have one of the arms going that way or you could also have because as you see like swimmers for instance now that is not essentially a somersault but it is uh, it can be a suggestion that we can even tuck this in more so we let's see if I can grab a different color for this because it's becoming a mess so we'll so body has to be shifted then more inward and the pec rising right up, arm coming right around right, right there and behind the head. You could also show that. And for that matter, you can also place the head in different ways. You could also have the head going backwards right there or you could even have the head going further backwards all the way like this like all the way back but of course you will have to change the placement of the arms and the shoulders along with it so I hope like that was of some help. Please let us have your comments and uh, your suggestions. Thank you for watching. Please uh, keep in touch. Do subscribe. Have yourself a wonderful day.